Welcome to Land of Lemurs here at the Calgary Zoo. We are actually in the back of the lemur building, uh, just out here in our courtyard with Manabe and Eni, two of our black and white rough lemurs. Black and white rough lemurs are one of three species here we have at the Calgary Zoo. They're the largest species that we have here. Black and white rough lemurs are critically endangered. Uh, there's estimated to be about a thousand to maybe 10,000 individuals left in the wild. Only in Madagascar, uh, like all lemurs, they're native only to that island. Manabe and Ene have been a match long in the making. Uh, although they're a relatively new pair here to us, it's been quite the journey to get them here. So Manabe arrived to us in 2017, and ever since then, we've been looking to match him with just the right mate. This is done through the SSP. So an SSP, or a Species Survival Plan, is a conservation and population management program for species at risk. These programs aim to maximize genetic diversity in a captive population, while also ensuring that it's demographically stable. Through the SSP, a coordinator and an expert group of advisors will look at all of the captive population data and make matches based on genetics, based on the number of individuals in captivity, and also based on the facility, the size of the facility, and uh, the current makeup of the individuals there. The SSP has to look at all of the population data to make sure we're getting the correct matches. Because captive populations of black and white rough lemurs are relatively low, we don't have a lot of genetic diversity. So once we had Manabe here and we knew he was quite a valuable genetic male, we had to ensure we had the right match for him. Here in North America, because that population was quite low and that diversity was quite low, we were looking globally for that right match. And that's why Eni had to make such a long trip to be here. She's traveled all the way from the Czech Republic and it's been quite a process to get here to this facility um, through a mandatory quarantining process and then finally introduced to Manabe. So they've had a couple months to be together now and we're starting to see that relationship grow. Eni is a dominant female so she is younger but she's dominant over Manabe so she's kind of got the rights to the goodies. We're starting to see them eat together really nicely. We're seeing some playful moments. They're vocalizing together. That's a great start and we'll just keep letting them bond together and uh, hope that they're a great match behaviorally as well as genetically. We do hope in the future though that they will be a successful pair and that's really going to change the dynamic here at Land of Lemurs.